Ladies and gents, hello and welcome. My name, of course, is Orbital Potato. We are currently at war with Egypt. This is Civilization V. This is also us playing as India, as nuclear India, actually, although we're not quite nuclear yet. And, uh, yeah, we're, we're very easily beating off the Egyptians. We're very easily uh, beating back the Egyptians. Never say beating off in relation to in relation to anything, Potato. You should know this by now. You should know this. Um, there is a settler over there, and I want me that settler. Holy cow, I do. Wow. All right, couple of barbs over here. Not super keen on the fact that they're just chilling. Yeah, that's that's really not great, but you know shit happens, I guess. Let's move on up here. Ooh, there are barbarians over there. There be barbarians on the horizon. Yeah, move over here. You won't be able to shoot, but yeah, whatever. Um, let's just take out the remaining soldiers. There seems to be no reason why these guys should even exist anymore. Just gonna eliminate them from the face of the earth. Um, and is this trader ready to be traded? Because it should should, at the end of the last episode, I think we sent it from Majuria to Delhi, and what we actually want to do is get production to be transferred from Delhi to Calcutta. Like, it's not going to make a, a massive difference. Wait, this is one food from districts in Calcutta, so is this going to slow the growth rate? I don't really want to be doing that, so... One food from district in Calcutta. Okay, so I guess if we want... Okay, we want to transfer it to Calcutta then. Right? Like, that's that's absolutely what we want to do. Yeah, I think we probably want to get it to Calcutta. So that we get food from Delhi. Right? Like, that. that's how we want it to be, right? Let's get a ranged attack. Honestly, Cleopatra, you don't even stand a fucking chance. Like, my army is... Is, is gargantuan in comparison to yours. Okay, we've got this missionary that is brand new. We're gonna send him up here. That's, that's a big ask. That is a big, big, big ask. And I still don't know if we can only get religion to cities that have holy districts, although this city doesn't have a holy district, although it is a city-state. I still don't understand that whole uh, religious mechanic. I'm sure I should probably research that, but... I'm not too concerned. Now, it says you are happy with me, but I am actually kind of ready for you to declare uh, a sneaky war on me. All right, you're going to build a mine over here because, as it turns out, apprenticeship can be boosted if we just build it. If we, if we just build it. If we just built a third mine. We're going to move you inside the city so you can't die. And then we're going to absolutely wreck you. And as it turns out, the builder disappears, which totally works for me because it means we no longer have to, to babysit the dude, which is fine. Um, we're still running a slight surplus in terms of gold, although it's rather questionable uh, how long that surplus is going to be maintained for. I'm not too worried, though. It, should be, it should be fine. No one ever becomes a master. Oh, wow, that, that was fucking deep, bro. Um, industrial zone is pretty pretty cool. I kind of like the idea of an industrial zone. Let's finish you off. Jeez, I should stop saying this. Finish you off, beat off the Egyptians. I, I really, really potato. Not very good at this whole thing. All right. Um, three food from districts in Delhi. I don't really care about. Don't really care about any of that. I care about production. Like, how do I increase production? Sure. Calcutta receives plus three food, plus one. All right. It's not going to slow. It's not going to slow the growth rate in Delhi. It might actually end up slowing the growth rate in Delhi. I don't really give a shit, though. Like, Delhi's big enough. Um, Build a water mill? I, I actually do want to build a mill. Whatever the hell it is. Is that it? No. Where the fuck is the mill? It's around here somewhere, but it's it's damned good. Yeah, here it is. Water mill. We do want to build it, because it's actually really, really damned good. Um, build an iron mine. We can boost that, but we don't have any workers at the moment, unfortunately. So, yeah. We'll just build... We'll just go for the night, I guess. Six turns. Or actually, maybe the lumber mill. Huh. Let's go for machinery. We own more than three archers anyway, so... 
no biggie there. Okay. Power up your bows and arrows. And that'll do just fine, thanks. So, if we... There's hills there. That's annoying. We move up here. We'll stand us in good stead. And we'll fortify you. Improvement pillaged. Fuck. Really? Oh, that's annoying. We should be able to take these guys out with this one shot, right? There we go. Perfect. Um, slingers aren't too much of a problem. They're still very capable of, like, pillaging stuff, but... Not a big deal. Uh, there's clearly a barbarian camp down here, so we're going to go and see to that. Fingers crossed, it's uh, it's relatively easy to deal with. Okay, this is annoying because that is one of Egypt's specialist movements. Uh, specialist movements? Specialist units, so I think they do a little bit more. Uh, okay, as it turns out, Egypt is helping me by weakening their own troops. All right, that is... That is actually fantastic. That is that is great. You cannot disagree with that. That's pretty darn good. All right. I don't really I don't really feel like I want to crush Egypt, but I feel like they are gonna die. You know. Okay. Did that take them low enough for us to infiltrate them? No, it didn't. Uh, we're gonna fortify you. You are going to continue pelting those dudes. Barbarians approach. Barbarians do indeed approach. We're going to try and see that we kill these barbarians in good timing. You're still heading up to the city up there. That's that's fine. That's not a big deal. We're about to get a new envoy. And honestly, it's kind of useless because we don't actually have any other city-states to communicate with. Calcutta needs more housing. Ooh, that is not good. That is definitely not good. We are building the monument. We do need to be building Petra, and that needs to be done very, very soon indeed. What tiles are we actually managing here? One, two, three. That needs to be improved. That needs to be improved right now. We need to get a mine on here, pronto style. Uh, I'm not too concerned about the sheepies, but definitely something that needs to be done. Hmm. Yeah, that's, that's, that's annoying. But Calcutta is going to become one of the biggest cities in our... In our area, to be honest. It really is. It really, really is. Here's my question, though. Is the fact the fact that we don't have housing, the fact that we do not have housing, um, does that slow our growth rate? 83 turns for pet. Oh, holy shit. We need granary. Yeah, get, get, get the granary. That's better than the monument. Um, let's get you to go off and do a little bit of exploration around here. Around these parts okay that's all done cool I guess we'll get you to do a little bit of exploration too cool good stuff everyone good stuff you're gonna attack you're gonna attack the archers holy shit well that was actually remarkably effective 77 damage It's not something I expected. That is not something I expected. If you attack here, you would get it, actually. Okay, we're going to put you on Fortify there. You are going to retreat like you never saw the enemy. Because you're on one HP. One singular HP. Jeez Louise. What did the world come to? And we're going to put you on Fortify. You can go on Fortify. No, you're exploring, aren't you? Yeah, I forgot about that. Oh, look. There's a, a barbarian boat. And you can come down here. Because you're going to take out the barbarians, which is great. And we'll go to the next turn. Good stuff, everyone. Uh, do barbarians capture missionaries? If so... Oh, fuck's sake, that was my upgraded archer. Damn, damn, damn. And unfortunately, unfortunately, there was both a unit that was destroyed, and also the settler went in completely the wrong direction. For my liking. We are going to fuck with them, right? We are absolutely going to fuck with them, but unfortunately, not for now. 
Let's move you away from that area and up to there. We can send another envoy, but I don't really want to because we've got too fucking many envoys. Like, I'm pretty sure we're the only person. Yep, we're the only person, only civilization that actually influences uh, Jerusalem right now. We're seven fucking envoys. Jesus Christ. Is that entirely necessary? I, I, I don't know. I don't feel that that's necessary at all. Um, we're going to put you on fortify until healed. You're going to come and have a decisive victory down here. And holy cow, it looks like next turn we might be able to just straight up take out the barbarian encampment. That's really, really good. That As is really, really out, good indeed. Mount oh! Kilimanjaro is not Wi-Fi enabled. So I had to spend two weeks in Tanzania talking to the people on my trip. Oh, wow. That, that, that's, that, what a quote. What, what a fucking quote. I mean, Wi-Fi hasn't been invented yet. It's not even close to being invented, but fucking sweet. I still have no idea what Kilimanjaro does. One tile, impassable, natural wonder, it appears as a mountain provides, plus two food on adjacent tiles. Fuck me. Holy shit, the growth rate in that city must be crazy if there's fucking five food there. You want, you want to make peace? Um, I'm going to refuse your deal for now. Because I am reasonably confident that I'm going to be able to take... Oh, for fuck's sake. Really? You're going to declare war? Why? Why is everybody declaring war on me? This is actually... Like, am I just being the most unlucky dude in the history of the world? Or is this super broken? Then he turns up the heat. If it's natural to kill... Oh, great. Let me deal with that in a minute. Let me first take the settler. I am going to take this settler for my own. Oh, baby. This feels good. This feels great. Uh, we can hit that unit. We would have a major victory. But unfortunately, I think I want to try and... Uh, I want to try and make peace. No? You, you don't want to make peace now? Really? Um, okay, so I'm gonna make peace and, and now they'll accept this? Alright, sweet. You give me... You give me fucking all of your gold. That's, that's great. I mean, I took one of your settlers and so, quite frankly, that was... That was a completely profitable war for us. Um, is this a great scientist that I'm gonna be claiming? Oh, beautiful it is. Our dedication... Our dedication... Whatever, don't care. Uh, let's get the great scientist. Are you the great scientist? I presume you're the great scientist, right? Yeah, you are. Is this our campus? Gain 100 faith. Holy Site District uh, provides science as well. Um, we don't have a campus yet. Like, we really do not have a campus. Maybe I'll just keep you and just sleep you. Yeah, I might just do that, to be honest. That might be worth it. Also, how can I repair that district? I don't know. Do I have to do it with builders? I'm presuming I have to do it with builders. Sending another fucking envoy to, uh... Fucking Jerusalem, really? Is that necessary? I feel that it's not. Either way, let's take the barbarian uh, camp. 45 gold, a little bit of money here and there. Never... Never go wrong with a little bit of cash. Fuck's sake, why? Like, I'm not even... I'm not even a fucking warmonger. Like, not even fucking close. Not even bloody close. Um... Builder, got a lot of stuff to build. Uh, in fact, you do. You actually have a, an iron mine over here to build. Uh, let's get you back to base because we're going to want to defend against the hordes of stinking archers that are going to be coming back. And those chariot archers really are not going to treat me very favorably at all. Well, I guess we'll move you over to this city. Yeah, you can go to sleep because I do want a, a science district first because I want to put it into science, not faith. I'm not, you know, I'm not... not super bothered about, uh, about faith, but I do want... I do want science. Like, I've, I'm, I'm doing good for faith right now. I'm doing good for faith right now. Oh, we did get some new civic stuff that I didn't even look at. Um, doesn't really matter. 
doesn't really matter at all. Okay, you come over here. That's fine. There we go. Two volleys. That's good stuff. Let's move you on top of the builders and then immediately fire. Yep. Expected result. Let's move you over here. Unfortunately, we will be in range of the barbarians, but that's not really an issue at all. Uh, up here and over here. It's a little bit risky going near the, the horse, warrior, archer people things, but should be fine. Um, the problem is, is that we don't actually have any location that's nearly good enough to found a city. Like, I guess up here? Like, this is, this is fucking fertile land up there. Like, that is, that is good stuff, right? But, first of all, you need to fortify until healed, and you're gonna be linked with that dude so that we can create a, like, a, a mini little escort thing. Get a decisive victory over here, just finish this nonsense up. Defeat the, the rest of the barbarians. I'm actually gonna keep this, uh, heavy chariot down in this area so that barbarian camps don't spawn, because as far as I'm concerned, if it's the same as the last game, then they won't spawn unless, uh, you know, there is land for them to spawn. But if, but if we always keep a unit there, then they should never be able to spawn. Unfortunately, archers took a little bit of damage. You shouldn't be able to fire at me. That's, that's fine. You're gonna fortify until healed. You are gonna get your, get your swagger on. Pretty sure you're actually almost dead. Yep, you're dead. Sweet. Now you are gonna fire on those guys. We're actually wrecking this army already. Like, it's not even funny. Major victory to take those guys out. Sure. Uh, I, should, I shouldn't have done that. Well, actually, it didn't really matter. Uh, yeah, let's retreat you all the way over here. Kind of sucks that you're kind of low life, but... I haven't needed to build a new uh, inventory unit for a damned long time, actually. So can we spread this religion? Is that going to work? Are you now religious? Like, tell me that that's the, the case. I still have no fucking idea how this religion mechanic actually works. I mean, yes, I understand that these bars are supposed to say... Oh, yeah, you know, 50% of the people are religious. You know, four out of four people are religious. Four out of seven people are religious. But why is it not spreading over here? That, to me, does not make sense. I should uh, probably do a little bit of research into that. But that's no matter. I'll, I'll do that. I'll do that soon. And I have no idea why I can't spread religion over there. Anyway, I guess the settler is going to be going up here, like... This is a city here, which we could probably get away with raising. Oh, that's a... Uh, it's a bit of a cheeky... Bit of a cheeky little bit of damage that you, you put in there. Uh, it's not so cool. There we go. There we go. Let's get you into the city. There we go. The horses run away into the jungle. And now that we're in the city, we should be able to recuperate a little bit of, uh, a little bit of health. Let's move you over there. Move you over there. And with that, we've pretty much cleaned the enemy up. I mean, I have no idea why they're actually going to war, just to, like, gift me... Gift me points. Gift me points, gift me experience, gift me a bunch of stuff, actually. Um, we do have a mission for Jerusalem to build a commercial as a commercial zone, a commercial hub thing. But I, I do want a, ca a, a, a fucking campus, actually. Although I wanted to build it in Calcutta. But I guess we can just build one here. Like, that's it's fine. Yeah, it's only one science, but I guess it'll totally be worth it, right? Like, it's got to be worth it. It's got to be worth it. I mean, we, we've got, like, an amphitheater place over here, which is kind of cool. You're full HP. There's barbarian shenanigans going on down here. Let's see to it that the barbarians never, ever exist. Oh, I didn't realize that you can go off the edge of the map over there. That's kind of cool. Um, 
Unit needs origin. Let's spread religion again. Like, I have no idea how this stuff actually works, although it should now be... Yeah, now it's totally, it's totally there. All right. I spread, I spread religion to you, which means that he should actually be a little bit happier with me. Believe it or not. I want to see this city. Like, is it a city that we can take down? Or is it not? Because a city situated right here would be great. I mean, look at the food. Look at the, look at the everything. Like, it would just be fantastic if we could get a city right there. So we're going to do it. We're absolutely going to do it. Calcutta's new housing is unfortunately going to take a little bit of time, but it shouldn't be too much of a problem. Um, yeah, let's just try and get a little view of this city. Even if that archer gets attacked, I, I, I don't really care, to be honest. Okay, you are going to recuperate until you're fully healed. You're also going to head out this way. See exactly what's going on in the jungle. Do we have any other units? Yes, we have you. Let's get you to come down here and see what's up. What's hip and happening. I'll give you a promotion. Sure. And the builders should now be going to work on the... Uh, the iron mine. Which is going to be really, really good. Really, really important that we get that set up. Alright, let's head into the jungle. The thing I hate about the jungle is that the visibility is pretty much garbage. Also, that's a super, super, super important tile for us to get. Because it's going to super, super, super speed up everything, actually. Uh, and then you're going to come over to this area. And fingers crossed, we should be able to build a sheepy district. Which is not going to give us a huge amount of production. In fact, I don't think it's going to give us any production. But it'll be worth it. St. Petersburg... A lot of good stuff here. A lot of good stuff that we can choose from. Plus four faith. Must have founded a religion. Must be adjacent to a holy site. Grants two apostles. I mean, that would be kind of cool. That would be kind of cool, actually. Yeah. Um, there's nothing else that we want. I would love an industrial zone. I would love, love, love an industrial zone. How the hell is there three production from this tile here? I'm actually going to take that, you know? Like, I'm I'm totally going to take that. Like, that is very worthwhile. And it does kind of shred our growth a little bit, but... Boy, oh boy, is it worth it. I mean, I'm sure we'll be able to build, like, a farm or something else elsewhere. Or even get, like, a trade route or something set up to supplement the... Uh, the food income of St. Petersburg, but eh, it doesn't really matter, I guess. It's not a big dealio. Alright. You're gonna move into the jungle. You're gonna move into the jungle. We're very close to seeing exactly what is up over there. Okay, you move down here. Oh shit, the barbarians have got swordsmen. Alright, they're gonna shred my archers when they attack me. That's worrying. That's very, very worrying indeed. Okay, ladies and gents, we're going to finish up here. My name, of course, has been Open Potato. This has been Civilization VI. Um, playing, of course, as Nuclear India. In the next episode, we should be moving on up in the world. Calcutta is going to be maturing into an awesome state. Uh, an awesome state? An awesome place. Um, as soon as we get a little bit more production over here, and then we should be able to build Petra in short order after the granary. Fingers crossed, it shouldn't be too difficult. Anyway, ladies and gents, thanks very much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye.